We have officially completed day seven of Sophie's training and we're gonna be working on a little bit of healing today. We've practiced it some, been on a couple walks, but it's not quite where I would like it yet. So we are gonna go back to the basics with some luring and practicing rewarding her when she's walking next to me. And then we can um, add in some e-collar stem once she gets the hang of it. So um, I have her kibble again. She works really well for this. And a lot of what I'm going to do when I walk is hold my hand and make her work for it right here. And every now and again, I'm gonna release one of those uh, pieces of kibble out of my hand to reward her so that eventually we can walk and start spacing out our time between rewards. And as long as Sophie is walking next to me, she knows that she will eventually be paid for walking in this position. Good girl. That's a good girl. What I don't want to do is reach my hand, let me turn this way, is reach my hand further out and be rewarding her when she's this far ahead of me because then that will be the expectation um, whenever she walks. I would like her um, about her collar or her ear in line with where the seam of my pants would be. Don't steal the treats from my pouch. And then that is how she's going to be, get paid. So if I am inconsistent about sometimes rewarding her here and then sometimes rewarding her back here, same idea, I don't want her um, slagging behind um, whenever we're walking. I would like about right here. And then again, every now and then, I'm gonna release a piece of that kibble and pay her as I'm encouraging her to heal. That's a good girl, Sophie. Good, so whenever we line up, good, sit, good. And we've worked on a little bit of an auto sit as well, meaning every time we stop, she goes to offer that sit and then is gonna get paid for it again. So um, since it's a little bit windy, hopefully you can hear me in this intro. I'll fix the video if not, but I'm gonna go ahead and speed this up and do a little bit of healing around the yard and show you what it's gonna look like. 